High water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Let's see what theme might come up for you this week. Nine of Cups. So you're focused on yourself, which is a great, because I think that's really needed. Um, I feel also with this, you are attracting, um, I want to say abundance, but you're attracting abundance not only in sort of, when I say abundance, I feel a lot of people feel that it's money. I feel you're attracting it in many forms, to be honest with you. The focus is on you, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go into what I'm feeling, but I want to pull up, uh, before I do that, I want to actually pull um, a card to check, and it's just really telling me your energy is more in alignment with you feeling a bit more content with yourself than you have. Um, like more independent you're more content um you you know you're carrying you you're proud to be you you you're back in your space um and probably working on yourself working on your manifestation i said blossoming abundance didn't i there we go um number three is significant for you um with the number three significant for you i'm also getting a message of how do you decide like are some of you thinking how to decide either way to go forward or on a decision whether it's your manifestation um it could be around your stability it could be around union it could be around love it could be around a new home some form of something that makes um you feel stable um, also, if you're seeing 1111, it's going to be uh, significant for you. Um, but this is really good energy, actually, because you're feeling stable within yourself. And I've also got a bit higher toned in my voice. So I feel like some of you could be feeling like you can actually speak up a bit more this coming week about the, um, or maybe it's, you know, it's you finding yourself, you know. Judgment is out here. So what is the judgment card about? Is that about you? Um, I feel that spirit is guiding you. If you've been asking for an answer, do ask your angels for signs. I, I, I feel like there might be um, judgment coming back around for you. And that's where, you know, starting to feel more aligned. Page of Cups, there could definitely be with the Four of Wands, Page of Cups and Judgment love coming in for you um i want to just check something Yeah, I, I do think there is some sort of decision that you might be asking um, and you might be looking internally. Maybe there's a bit of emotional chaos with the Page of Cups as well. And that's what you're asking guidance on. There might be some nostalgia with, this, with the Six of Cups. But what I really feel is that with the Four of Wands and Six of Cups as well, some of you... There is a soulmate or a spiritual connection with someone coming in or is already within your energy. You might know who they are. And this person is, is definitely um, a soulmate connection. With that, they don't necessarily have to be loved. I think there's also some emotional cleansing that ha is happening for you. This might be around, you know, th with the judgment card, it might be around people that have been unfair to you and you've kind of moved on. You're recognizing who you are. You're feeling more stable within yourself. You're trying to make some judgments about some internal decision that you have. 
Um, there is a spiritual connection with someone. At the same time with the Page of Cups, I wonder if some of you are still trying to make sense and with the decision on your um, sort of uh, internal emotional chaos that you might be feeling on the judgment you need to you need to make a, a ten of wands is here which is telling me there's a completion about this um but also it's telling me you do need to leave the heaviness behind and so i wonder if you're deciding to put this down leave it behind you're feeling more in yourself and there's someone or people that are like I'm not liking this. They're not in the energy that they were in. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. They're moving, they're feeling themselves more. They're more confident, they're more content. They're more at looking the way forward. They're more at um, what, um, uh, they're more within themselves, you know. They're working on themselves. There's a different glow to them than the heaviness may be the felt or whatever's been going on around them. And so you might need to do an emotional cleanse, which could be a challenging decision for you from some people that you know are not necessarily happy to see you like this or aligned. There is, and this could be challenging. You could also not be seeing this. And this could also be around the internal chaos that comes up which is triggering a bit of fear and anger that might come up for you. But there is guidance and it does tell you to persevere and continue working on yourself and your, your way forward. A sign if it's true. Ooh, too many signs. Ace of Wands, a breakthrough is coming through um for you there is definitely a gift on the horizon Fool. so i think you're stepping into this new you um and you just need to be careful about the people who are around you there's definitely a spiritual connection with someone coming in as well and you are being guided. Let's just look at this card a minute. I do think you need to continue working on yourself. And I also do think that you need to um, continue with your independence. Um, uh, why did I lose what I, what I saw on the other card? One second, sorry about this. Yeah, continue to plow forward and it's encouragement and a gift is coming in for you. I just want to pull a card from this card deck. Yin and Yang, balance yourself when needed as well. Balance that internal chaos that might come up. With this week's astrology, if you've not tuned in, listen to it. This might be where you go back and forth between being in sort of aligned with yourself, feeling good, but then not so good. And it could be down to these people why do I keep wanting to look at this <laughs> oracle card of the same one? But there's definitely new beginnings here. And I do think you need to trust and listen to your gut. Stay away from drama. And people that might be drama causing you more chaos. Um, I'm seeing a better alignment of your energy, which is beautiful. Okay, water signs, I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you're staying with us for air signs, because you've got air placement, please do. If not, I'll see you in the next reading. Take care for now. Bye.